Today's gonna be a hard day. Today's gonna be the first day that I've started filming again. It's a really hard day. If I start just talking about products or something, it's just because I, I'm, I'm battling. Um, today, uh, we need a family day. My parents are on their way over here. And um, if you hear a lot of panting, it's Lincoln is with me. Uh, Lincoln has not left my side. I think he's a little stressed because Lincoln already has like, I didn't know, I mean, it's not surprising that animals can have anxiety, but Lincoln has really bad anxiety. And he has had, been very stressed since I took Carly. And so I think it's been really hard for him and I think he knows uh, we're gonna be leaving today. And so I think he's really stressed about that because he has always had his calming goat, as we call Harley. Harley was his calming goat because he would always help him with his anxiety and his stress and kind of let him be. It is not a uh, hair and makeup day. Today is a let's just try and get through the day. And I'm sure some of you guys are like, why are you filming? Well, this is exactly what I need. If I'm not looking at you, I'm sorry. I need to keep going. We're gonna have our family day. You guys saw, uh, if you watched like my Halloween hauls, you know, my Halloween decor haul video this year that I did earlier in the month, um, I got them some little crafty things and one was going to be for friends and one was going to be for just like us family we might do the whole big one today we might do it all today i just think that's what i need and my kids need and they would do well with something like that but yeah we're gonna do that today we need to get the kids halloween costumes um we need to do all the little family halloween things today we need to go get their pumpkins i know i'd like to go out to lunch or something too to just like for normalcy um, but, I mean, why does in and out sound good? I mean, my kids love in and out and love it and my parents love it and out. So it might be in and out day. Also, too, I'm trying to be festive. And so things like that help me. And so I'm going to do that. But we're going to be positive. We're going to move forward. I don't know what this video is going to look like. And I'm just going to say that. I don't really know what it's going to look like. And I don't really know how good it's going to be. So, but it's kind of for me help get me going again. I need to learn how to live. I'm gonna make sure Lincoln's okay before I leave. I'm re we're gonna have a good day. It's gonna be a um, a progressive day. Today's gonna be a big progressive day. We're gonna progress to day one. So, I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you for being here. Um, Let's, let's go have a good, let's go have a good family day. This is a good day as any 
to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many. When the old one's gone under the knife, and I can feel the sun on my skin, beginning to thaw from within. Today and not tomorrow, there's no time to borrow. Today is a good day. <sighs> I got through the day. I actually feel much better than how we started this video today and I know this video is not much but to be honest it's it's really for me um, and it's I think like a step for me for getting through a day that's okay and starting to kind of live life that's a little bit more normal I'm I'm really proud because it really was a good day and I was able to move forward with the day and be comfortable with the day and I feel like it turned out really well this camera's gonna die <laughs> All right, it's not gonna be as good now because now I'm just filming on my phone. But I, um, like I said, today was not a day for you guys. Like I know that it sounds horrible to say it like that, but today was kind of a day for me to un essentially get ready to film the video to explain kind of what happened. And for you guys, it's not that big of a deal, but like I, let me say this. I am not, uh, I am an oversharer. <laughs> I don't know how to not share everything. I don't know how to like hold things back. I don't know how to be private. I don't know how to do that. I am as open book as probably you'll ever meet. I'm just, that's just my nature. I don't know how to like hide things. I, I don't, I'm not good at that. And so if I don't say it, I feel like I'm hiding. And I know you guys have seen Harley a lot and you guys have, you know, got to see bits and pieces, but you don't know to the level of um, how important he was to me. But I need to now learn to move forward without him. And that includes being on here. And if I'm not transparent, like I said, I feel like I'm hiding. And I can't hide this. I can't. So, I'm proud. <laughs> I know it doesn't look good. I'm proud. We had a really nice day though. There was no tears. <laughs> I've only had tears with you guys, to be honest. It's just because I'm talking about it and it's like a it's like a therapy session, you know. I feel like I'm having like a, a little therapy session. Um we had a nice day with my parents. I didn't film as much as I thought I was gonna film, but honestly it was just nice soaking up that part. But we went to Target and man, we were on a mission for Halloween costumes and it was really hard to find Halloween costumes. My son has a hard time like deciding on something because he's so much like me in the sense that like if he has like a visual in his head, like a dream in his head, like he hyper fixates on it and he like can't get past it. So then when he like, he wanted to be Deadpool, you'd think that would be so easy. It was not easy. I've looked all, and without spending a hundred dollars or more, I just don't do that game. I'm sorry. It was hard to find that, but we very much compromised. Uh, we have almost all of it. We got his accessories and that. Um, but at Target, they had in the men's section, cause he's like a men's small now. I got him a like, couple months back for pajama day one day. It was like one of the pajama onesies and it was Deadpool. So he wants to get like a mask for it and like the swords and do that. And I told him, I'm like, that's your costume because I said, we can't find it anywhere. And that's like all he wanted to be was Deadpool. So that was really hard. We got pumpkins, pumpkins. I'm sorry, but I bought them at Walmart for $4 and 50 cents. That was a win. Uh, I hate, I love going to a pumpkin patch and that, but to me, I don't have as much of a good experience here. I haven't found one that's like amazing to where I'll spend $30 on a pumpkin. I don't find that. So we saw them walking into Walmart today. We got them for $4 and 50 cents. That was perfect. The craft uh, thing I really enjoyed with them. I wasn't going to paint, but I'm like, you know what? Painting could be really therapeutic for me. So I did that with them. We baked cupcakes. It was just like a nice little family day. Usually on Sundays, we do Sundays. 
Sundays on Sunday. I'm not, it's like Taco Tuesday type thing. It's like our Sundays on Sunday. I was running around um, and I needed to get some like calming treats for Lincoln because Lincoln's struggling really bad. Like he's, he's really struggling. And I just got done editing. Um, so today is, let's hear, today is Sunday. I was filming a video that I filmed on Friday and Friday is when everything happened. And um, today, Sunday, there was no video and I, I couldn't do it. You know, I just, I couldn't do it. So I want tomorrow to kind of get back into Monday then to have a video for you guys again. But that was the day that he had passed. It was, it was a rough day and you could tell normally like he's very involved in the videos and he wasn't. And you saw Lincoln a lot in the video and Lincoln was just like pacing back and forth. Like you could tell like he, like the whole house, I feel like the whole house knew something was up and I was the only one that didn't. It was, it was, it was sad to see that because essentially how you see Lincoln like pacing in the, you, you see like bits and pieces and you probably wouldn't even notice it unless I'm mentioning it. But he was just like pacing. He has such bad anxiety. And he had a really hard time when we were getting ready to leave today. He, it, it wasn't happening. There was, there was no way. And so Jason ended up staying back with him. And I mean, we got to give him some grace too. I mean, this has been 20, not even 24 hours yet, you know. So maybe it's been 24 hours now. Yeah, it's been 24 hours. Almost 48 hours. Oh my God. Has that been that long? No. Happened yesterday early morning. So yeah, it's been 24, just over 24 hours. Tomorrow morning will be 48 hours. So it was, it was hard for him. And so Jason stayed home and then made sure he was okay. But I went to the store and got him some like calming pills, uh, calming treats to kind of tame him down. We've had to get those before for him and they, they do help. I just want him to be comfortable. I don't want him stressing and Lincoln's 10. So I don't want him stressing at his age either because that's not good. So... And for everyone that's going to tell me, you know, they usually go together. Yeah, I know because my mom just lost her dog and Harley and Charlie was her dog. They uh, were like brothers when they were younger. And, you know, when we were all back home and everything, they were so close. Like even a year ago, they were so close. I'm trying to prep for that too. But I'm being really chanty in my therapy session here but like I said I know this is probably not like a video for you guys and you're like this is the most boring video ever it's just me trying to grieve and be honest because like I said I can't hide stuff like I just I I really need to learn to not overshare but that's why I belong here right that's why I have a channel and I do I'm doing daily videos right now I'm I'm sharing everything so I want I want to share this because it is a he's a huge part of my life. So thank you for helping me with today. I appreciate it. I'm done crying, <laughs> but tomorrow I know I have to film a video explaining because then then I feel like I can officially move on and I'm not hiding anything and I'm ready to go. But I'm gonna go take a bath. I think. Thank you for your support and thank you for letting me just be raw. I, I, I appreciate it a lot and thank you for always showing up you know I I appreciate that so thank you if you enjoyed this video I'm not doing that I'm sorry thank you love you guys I appreciate you thank you for being a platform for me to express how I feel and be open and raw and therapeutic apparently so thank you and I will see you guys tomorrow bye guys